What's good with y'all boys, man? I hope y'all are staying blessed as always and welcome back to a brand new video. And in today's video, I'm back on the Slim Reaper Kevin Durant replica build. Now, I've been having a ton of fun on this build, getting chase down blocks, snatch blocks, contact dunks, limitless threes, mid-range pull-ups, post fades, whatever it is, man, this build can do. I won't be showing you guys the stats or how to make this build in today's video. That will be this video right here just a couple videos ago. If you want to know how to make this build go ahead and watch that but in today's video i'm gonna be showing you guys the dribbling animations that i use on this build specifically because i was getting a lot of questions about that my last 610 dribble moves or dribble tutorial video was like back in season two so i definitely gotta bring y'all some new ones for season four as i switched up my animations myself now i know y'all i've been uploading like once a week and i have to make a guard academy part two and i do have to make a dribble tutorial for the 610 so y'all could take these dribble moves and actually use them in game i'll get to that bro i've just been dealing with some other stuff but nonetheless man we got some dope ass 610 gameplay bro i'm gonna be trying to dribble more than usual for these clips so you can really see how these dribble moves work but if you're ready for this video go ahead and drop a like subscribe to the channel if you want more content like this let's go ahead for the best 610 plus dribble moves in the game if you guys want to grab up a 2k labs premium membership you can use code koza for 20 percent off they have the exact green windows the exact make percentages of all the jump shots and even the best animations in the game so if you guys don't want to watch content creators like me you can have the full spreadsheet of all the stats in the game right in front of you now these next clips are from two full gameplays so this is just two straight up games i just clipped what was good in the games but it did not take me long bro to get these clips bro because the dribble moves are consistent but real quick i want to give you y'all these two souped like little moves that aren't really dribble moves but they will help you out a lot it's the kevin durant hop jumper again if you're 610 and above 610 611 use the kevin durant hop jumper even if you fake it and combo it in with your dribble moves or just fake a hop jumper they will most likely jump as you will see in today's video and then that will lead to like an open basket another thing is the kobe bryant dribble threats or triple threat style you get the good uh the jab step the good spin out of it like you just seen right there and just those two little things that aren't necessarily dribble moves i wanted to get out the way because i do use them a lot and they do work well for me so i just want to get them two out the way real quick now my dribble style did change i'm using pro over joel Embiid. i used to use joel Embiid, and it was really fast towards the off ball hand but it was so easy for the defender to tell what you're about to do and you were so one dimensional and i just like using pro i can go both ways and especially speed boosting towards my off ball hand i really like that because i really you know i, I play rec a lot i ain't gonna lie I'm, I'm becoming an old head but i play rec a lot and there's not enough room to be taking those wide crossovers you just got to do what needs done to get a bucket and the Joel B dribble style it just took too much it was at too much of an angle and I was I was messing up the spacing and pro just ended up working out better for me I still like the Joel B dribble style especially for looking glitchy but for right now pro is just working out better for me on this build specifically now for size up this is an easy one for me Giannis is one of the best size ups in the game and you get it at 610 and above could you imagine that but you could still use Kawhi and Leonard and even pro pro kind of looks a little glitchy kind of looks like a little bit more of a jamal crawford type dribble style where you know just a little bit more swag to the, the pro dribble style but to get the job done and be quick off the dribble Giannis Antetokounmpo is the dribble style to go with or not the dribble style the size of my fault the size up and that's what I'm rocking on my 610 plus builds now this is the big one that I changed but I used to use LeBron James for the AI step back or the hop back but now I'm using Kevin Durant Kevin Durant still has a really good hop back it's really fast you can speed boost out of it really fast but he also has good misdirections behind the back big crab crossovers that you can use it's just an all-around well-rounded size of escape package and you see a lot of 6869 67 builds use this and again you get it at 610 bro and you even get at 611 if you go a minimum wingspan so it's like bro like if if you don't get Kevin Durant you could go ahead and use LeBron LeBron you get at a 70 ball handle Kevin Durant you get at a 75 and you can't go wrong with either one you can combo into either of them my last dribble tutorial I used LeBron James uh, size of escape package so if you want to know how to use that or if you're forced to use that you can go ahead and watch this video right here and it'll help you out a lot by the way I left that in the video but I don't know what that man did he got like a contact dunk but then he had a out of bounds under the basket foul I don't know what that was y'all could rewatch it I don't know what the fuck happened but the man got a contact dunk animation but it was out of bounds and it was just it was just weird and it was their ball I don't know bro like Ronnie gotta fix this shit now on the crossover this is huge because Donovan Mitchell has the best double attack 
attacking crossover in the game by the way if you guys have questions about how to do any of the moves that i'm doing in today's video just put the time stamp put the time of when i did it in the video put it in the comments explain which move it was so i know which move to go more in depth on and spend more time on whenever i come out with a dribble tutorial next but this double crossover move that you just seen right there it brings you forward you can step back out of it you can speed boost out of it and it's just a really really good effective move but the next few moves are pretty basic i'm using pro behind the back a lot of people use this move and again you get it at the 610 and 611 position so you can split defenders get on transition for the spin i use basic but i don't use it too much because i just don't really do all that extra shit anymore and then hesitation i'm using zach levine those three moves are you know the hesitation and, and the spin i don't use too much the behind the back definitely for sure especially in the rec when i'm trying to split a double team on the fast break or whatever the case may be pro behind the back is a very good move i don't really be spinning back too much anymore and i don't i really forget to use the hesitation a lot so y'all could put whatever you like better in there or you can rock with my moves it don't matter whichever works best for you and on the step back man i'm using normal for my asa slot i use my asa slot a lot when i'm bringing the ball down the court not so much in twos or ones but in threes and fives i definitely use my asa slot i love my asa slot i use on every building again you get it at the 610 build but i couldn't leave you i couldn't leave y'all hanging without giving y'all the jump shot this was you know really heavily questioned you know on my last video but this is the jump shot i'm using right here o'shea Brissett is my favorite base in the game and i got some new releases on the big man build now the cool thing is you only need a 78 three-point shot for this bro so i ain't gonna lie it's looking kind of crazy so if you have a if you're three point eight, you know an 85 86 as long as you got a 78 bro you could use the jump shot and it's working really really well for me but those are all of my dribble moves that i'm consistently using on my 610 slim reaper build make sure y'all like the video if you want more content on this build yeah i mean the views went went crazy on the last upload on this build but the replica it's it's i think it's the best replica in the game if not i think the greek freak or Giannis, you know he might have a better replica but this the top replica in the game usually replica builds are trash but this build it's so fun to play on the funnest build i have right now i know i only been uploading once a week now you know when i used to upload every day or every other day but i will get that guard academy part two out for the passing and the defense i will get this dribble tutorial for the 610 611 builds out i promise y'all i just been you know doing some you know some other stuff but y'all see what's happening in the nba bro kd just went to the sun so he's with chris paul devin booker lebron just hit his all-time scoring points like the nba is lit right now i'm not gonna lie so you know i'm hyped to get back on the game i'm hyped to start getting back in my recording bag i'm hyped to start running on this build a lot more because you see dude comboing up on this build is so satisfying but i hope y'all enjoyed the video drop a like if you did subscribe to the channel if you want more content like this as always i'll catch y'all in the next video or stream.